WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of very sunny, pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This year, 11 a.m. update, and we've got a sea of green out there. The only uh, sector inside the S&P 500 trading to the downside is the XLU. It's off 12 pennies. Dow's up 242 points, six tenths, one percent for the S&P, 50 points, one and a quarter percent for the Nasdaq 100, 230 points there, nine points for the Russell, 64 for the semis. You've got gold trading up 28 bucks. Silver's up six pennies. Light three crude is up 45. Since natural gas is up two pennies. 30 year Treasury is down nearly one point, printed out at 117.14. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini. What do we know about it? Well, it's got that Rhodes Mintum indicator top with price just simply trading with inside its profiles. The resistance zone, which it may tackle today, we'll try to figure that out when we look at the intraday charts, is up at 52.57 and a quarter. We're at 52.46 right now. Spot Volatonic still well above its 50-day exponential moving average. Uh, that says any surprises, we'll see a rug pull like we did yesterday uh, to the downside in the S&P 500. The NQ, and this is kind of interesting. So today is very, very likely going to form bar number eight of a TD nine count pattern. It will do that as long as price closes below. Uh, 18,497. But then on Monday, price has got to close below 18,330 out there. And what price did yesterday, this is kind of interesting. We talk about these bullish and bearish uh, profiles out there. And this was a, a bearish structured profile. Price was above it for well more than two consecutive sessions. And we can see that counter trend moves to the downside will find support at the center, which is at 18026. We've done that. So this has done that about three times, three or four times so far uh, during the last couple of weeks out there. So that's your real key area to watch 18026 to the downside price trade above the top of its profile that suggests a further rally if you take a look at the u.s dollar index it's just consolidating with inside its daily profile that's between the range of 10 uh, 10385 and 10430 uh, 34 out there. I believe gold is going to complete a TD9 count top today, but there is a new profile that is attempting to form. There was a question yesterday about new profiles. I am using my advanced Doppler tool out there. This profile has been in place really all evening long. Of course, it's the morning right now. 2235 is the top and 2271 is the bottom. Silver doing the same thing. Now, its profile is below price. That is a bullish message. That suggests that silver heads on up to the 2823 level. In the case of light three crude, just simply needs a bearish reversal candle to confirm a sell the deep point top otherwise price will target 87.62 consolidation inside of natural gas and the 30-year treasury continues to find support at the uh, bottom of its uh, uh, swing point from february 22nd folks have a terrific friday fantastic weekend and stay tuned for the trader's ed show we'll be right back